And just for the record, <laughs> I, I just want to say this as a man, we don't give a damn. Okay. You, you just okay. said she, she, he likes her because they're going out. If you're attractive and we smash and, and you want to walk down the street or go wherever, I don't care. Like you could tell they're no, not really spending no go. money because they're walking down the street. This they probably walking through like that. This is why y'all cannot mitigate everything to you guys' dating standards. I am not your peer. Men today who are my peers, they don't have to do that shit. They can literally go post up at a bitch house, go fuck her, and leave. He is not going outside with her. He is not spending you no money. Can on her. go outside he with her. This is what I'm saying, Mr. Lego. That's some shit you would do. But men today who are my peers in my age range, it don't have to be that deep. He not going outside with the chick he just smashing. They may meet and see each other at the club and leave together on some text and shit, but they not showing up together. They not posting up together. He not even going to give her that type of inclination. Y'all got to stop coming with this traditionalized mindset of some shit you will do because I know men right now who are my male friends he not even finna be seen outside with a bitch he just let you know put her mouth on him it's not gonna go like that so from what i'm seeing who are my peers these these people look like to be my peers i'm not your peer you could be my parent so what i'm saying is when you see a man and a woman outside together in this type of dynamic today he got some form of likability towards her because he don't have to do that if they were just having sex it would just be sick. He not well, going outside. I want to just say this. I want if you walking outside and they look like they in New Orleans or something. Yeah, they walking. Wait, a strip. Wait, wait, look. So like, so so if any man that I'm dating and we happen to you know get physical and not me, okay, we take me out of it because I don't like to get personal. But I feel like if you're dating a man and he likes you. He's not going to allow you to dress him as a friend. And if he does, he's going to be pissed because he's thinking that he didn't spend all his money and effort and everything. And you up here to friends on him on TV and it's going viral. He know he's I, I had dudes get mad that a finger wouldn't, I couldn't post a finger like, oh, you know, like, no, you're not getting on my social media. Like, so um, I'm all that to say, I don't think that he likes her. I think that he likes the, the sex. And it's absolutely fabulous because she got on waist beads. And I know I heard about that waist bead stuff. So I think that they doing some weird stuff in the bed. And he's absolutely trying to get her voodooed out. Like, yeah, baby, turn her on. You call me a friend, whatever. But if a man the, like you, I don't think he's going to let you. Okay, so I, went viral. The I fact that just went viral oh. on the camera. Oh, one at a time, y'all. One at a time. That the fact that it was a person who walked up to them outside in public see that's why i'm saying like the generations they're they're separated we're outside in public downtown it's a lot of people around if i got a roster of women do you think i'm gonna risk this do you think i don't know where they be and the fact that there's a random person who walking up to me in this era with a camera filming me i know it has the potential to hit somewhere and somebody see it and point me out do you honestly think I would be doing it with a woman I don't like, knowing that whoever can come back and see this could see it and that ruins all the other people that I had on my roster or even give me a headache? If he did not like her, he would not be sitting in public with her okay. in a large crowd. And if he did not like her, he would not have let them film him and answer them questions that way. Paris, some, you some are, dude, some dude hold on, hold on, hold on. I, I, I got to say this. Paris, you I'm, are loud and wrong, okay? You are a woman <laughs> talking about what men are thinking. Overall, if me and a woman is friends, remember, the man walked up to them randomly, okay? It's not like there's a news bus over there and everybody is... It, no, he randomly walked up with a phone. like. Like uh, they might be on uh on the strip in in uh in um New Orleans on the strip in on uh, Houston. They just right. hanging out. If me and a woman is just friends, I don't give a damn. We can go somewhere. I hang out with women I don't have sex with. I hang out with women I do have sex with. I don't. And then when it comes to a, a roster, we don't give a damn because they ain't going nowhere. Because guess what? We all know. If we have a roster of chicks, they probably got a dude somewhere anyway. So who gives a shit? 
Men don't really care about all that. We're not gonna be like, oh, get up, get up, get. Up. We ain't got no girl. We're talking about single men who ain't even claiming the girl they're walking with. Now, I'm not going to say we girlfriend and boyfriend on camera because now the other chicks that I mess with are going to be like, oh, what the hell are you doing over there? But if we're saying we are friends, I have no problem hanging out with, walking a strip with, they ain't even spending no money. That's how you could tell they're in a friendship because seeing walking down a strip like that you, uh, boyfriend and girlfriend usually don't don't, don't even do that that's that's friendship you shit. know what else um as far as him saying that they hit or they said or she said it because he, he wasn't it. even gonna say it say it but that makes his stock go up a little bit because Thank you yeah i'm gonna tell you it's some women in his dm already like i seen you go viral thank you how many People times no have anybody ass. went viral? I know I have went viral. Somebody came and like, what are you talking about? Mm -hmm. It's a horrible thing to go viral for. Like, why are you just trying to find a way to reconnect? So a lot of times women love competition, especially in this community. Um, and, and if a man tell a, one, a black woman, well, I don't want to say this, but I feel like if a man tell a black woman, hey, I'm not ready for a relationship. Just I just want to be friends. She going to really put it down thick. She yep. going to cook for him. Yeah. She going to ride it backwards. Mm -hmm. She going to get him a massage. She going to do everything that a girlfriend would do, even though he's already explained to her, Hey, I'm not looking for a relationship, trying to convince him this way it's at. And then when he end up with somebody else who ain't did half of that, she's psychotic. Okay. So, yeah, y'all oh, actually wait, think wait, men actually. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, y'all. Hold on, hold on. I'm going to come back around. Man. We got some folks that's been patiently waiting. I want to get to Trash, Smooth, Marcus, and Kim. Let me go ahead and get there. And then we'll come back around to everybody else. Uh, go ahead, Trev. Is Trev frozen? Trev? Yeah, I think, yeah, I think he froze. He talked. I'm hey, frozen. you on mute, bro. Yeah, no, you good now? I can see you. you. I froze. You <laughs> I don't, I don't yeah, good. All right, cool, cool. Gotcha. Um, yeah. So I did want to address Ali's question because she was asking if a do if y'all uh, end up smashing on like the first date. Um, I think that's not abnormal for for dudes to take take it to another level after that honestly um for me personally no though like because if if that happens right then i'm looking for like for long term it's like i, I would have always been more interested in more of a virtuous woman right so because that's that's different somebody who you would have fun with i see that as a totally different person and i would never be foolish enough to feel like i was special and I was just that guy that one time that ever met her that she just smashed on the first date. Where most dudes who have half a brain is not going to believe that that's the first time she ever did that. And if this, that's the type of behavior she exhibits, then guess what? You're probably not wifey material.